Hey guys, good morning, it's Sony. Before I start the video, I do want to say please like, subscribe, and comment. If you want to join the Patreon, you can join at patreon.com forward slash, but I'm not a trader. As of right now, I am eyeballing 460, 461 on SPX. You did just break the highs of 458, so you actually broke structure. And I think as of right now, we are headed uh, to break these highs of 460. I did say that I am calling a top right here. And after we hit this 459, we did drop a nice chunk to 454. That's only a five point drop. I wanted to see a much bigger, much, much stronger sell off. Um, but we have basically a full recovery in the span of like two days. So you basically already, you know, kind of, you know, gave this whole thing, this whole thing, you basically got, uh, you basically got bought up. So I'm running, you know, I definitely feel, um, what is it called? Um, I'm, that's why I'm like panting and stuff. You guys can hear me, but yeah, I'm definitely thinking that right now we are looking at breaking structure here. Would not be surprised if we do something like this, push up, come back, retest, and then completely push this to like 463 and higher. And you guys know my thesis on every single candle that closes above um, resistance. If we close an eight hour candle above this, right? Like a bullish eight hour candle. And you guys already know, this is basically how I run my longs. So we'll do this, right? If you close an eight hour candle above this, a bullish candle, right? Like this, I go to that, right? Can you see that? Let me fill this in a little bit. Boom, there we go. So if you close an eight hour candle like this, over this resistance, I 100% think we're going to 467. And that's just what, you know, break of weekly structure happens, right? So you break this weekly structure, look here. I'll, get, I'll show you guys, right? You break weekly structure, you push up to next level. And this happened within what? You broke it at November 20th and you hit that top on December 1st, first, so within 10 days, right? You broke this on November 13th and you hit this November 20th. So around, again, 10 days, right? You broke this November 10th. You hit this November 13th in about three days. So a little bit faster there. And then you broke this November 3rd and you hit that top November 8th, so five days. So we can really, you know, we can break this, right? And we can close something up here really in any kind of time frame. Um, so, you know, we can hit, if we, if we close an eight hour above this, you know, you can shoot up to 467, you know, within three days, 10 days, it doesn't matter. But if you close a bullish candle above this, I'm longing to 467 with like, you know, two, three week out um, options, right? And I'll probably do in the money just to be on the safer side, but it does look like, you know, we are starting to push towards the upside right now. Um, the daily might actually close bullish today. So I would not be surprised if you have some sort of squeeze, um, you know, today, later this week, anything like that. So I am eyeing that 460, 460 plus mark. So I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.